Hello everyone, Joshua Jackson here with Evolve Dentistry. Um, today I'm going to be reviewing some new features inside of the 3D Data Editor tool inside of 3.3 Chemex. Um, so here inside of uh, the 3D Data Editor, normally what we want to do is if we're trying to close a hole like this, we come here and we try and select that entire hole, but unfortunately sometimes internal scan data just falls short of that. And as you can see with this hybrid, what I'm looking to do is I'm looking to basically try and incorporate some of that roll data there. And I can see basically what, and I can imagine what the data would look like. Unfortunately, with closed hole, I'm not going to be able to do that. So they have this new feature called Clean Edge. And I'm going to go to Edit Surface, not Edit Through. Um, that's an important piece of this. And then I'm going to select this area here. And then now I'll come over to Bridge Gap. Okay, excuse me, maybe this area, and then go to Bridge Gap. Bridge Gap. Maybe let's go like this. There you go. And do bridge gap again. There you go. And then basically now that closes out the um, area here. I'm not sure if I'm uh, using the tool correctly, but I have somewhat of an idea of how this is working. Um, oh, there you go. And then you kind of close that like so. And go bridge gap. There we go. That's how you do it. So, yeah, basically what that's going to allow us to do is, you know, fill in um, uh, endpoints um, on data, whereas we wouldn't be able to do it before. And now you see, even if I create something like that, I can now close that hole. This is going to be really powerful for buckle roll um, data and also for things that may not be 100% closed, like in this area. Um, so we go to clean edge, uh, basically attempt to try this again and then go bridge gap. Yeah, there you go. So see, and then now we can go maybe even, and then go bridge gap. There you go. And oh, that's not what I wanted. We can basically go like this, go bridge gap, arc triangles, select through and through, and then close holes. You see, that's going to be extremely powerful for cleaning up uh, data. Um, and you see now, just come into here, do a little smooth. It's going to be really great. Obviously, that was a non-functional area, but with that buckle roll there, um, you know, that's just going to be really important uh, piece of data for me to make sure that I have the proper amount of tissue pressure here for this hybrid. All right. Thank you. And stay tuned for more on ExoCAD 3.3 Chillins.